I love my people. Therefore, I know my purpose is my people. My purpose is you. And I'm someone else's purpose. When we come together with the sense of unity and interdependence, a smile will bring on another smile. An act of love will bring on out another act of love. People that help us get through our day in other countries tend to go unnoticed or even or not even given the gratitude they deserve. And to that, I say thank you. Thank you for taking the time to help the ungrateful people of the U.S. Because as Dr. King says, we are inevitably our brother's keeper because we call because we are our brother's brother. Whatever affects one directly affects all indirectly. Self-transformation is not a solo journey. To better ourselves, we must look beyond ourselves, our desires, our cravings, our wants. To better ourselves, we must realize the eternal truth that we do not walk our path alone. Our betterment relies on our willingness to uplift others. I cannot be myself without you. Everything I see or touch has to do with you. Your hard work gives me shoes. Your handwork gives me vision. You and I are connected. You need me and I need you. Everywhere I go, I see your work. My shoes, my clothes, even my mask. I cannot be myself without you. In society, it's known to be selfish and just think me, me, me. But it's important to see the bigger picture on how it's important to see how anything other than yourself is critical and important. You may not know who created your clothes, but whatever affects them affects you too. It's necessary to get out of the self mindset and think about the fact that we're all united. We will not get to say thank you to all those who deserve it, but our actions can express gratitude every day. I recognize that every day I need to express gratitude for the clothes I wear and the food I eat. How would you feel to be the only person in the world? Some people might think that that would be paradise. Your clothes would not exist. The coffee you rely on to wake up in the morning would not exist. The tea that you drink to relax your mind before bed would not exist. The soap, the tables, the chairs, your phone would not exist. All life is interdependent. These are not recent concepts or ideas. In La Kech Alakim, a Mayan concept means I am because you are, and you are because I am. Ubuntu, a South African, a South African precept means I am your other you, you are my other me. Society has taught us individualism, but our ancestors have always known we are connected and dependent on each other. This is our world house, and we are pushing our brothers and sisters into the basement. It's time we invite them to the dinner table and feast with them. Thank you.